La crise en mer rouge épargne les consommateurs, du moins pour le moment. L'augmentation des prix causée par les attaques de navires marchands est contenue. Les délais de livraison sont eux en hausse, en particulier pour les meubles et les voitures. A number of large companies, particularly container lines, have made the decision now to reroute their ships away from the Red Sea and will be going instead around the south coast of South Africa, around the Cape of Good Horn, which adds about 9,000 kilometers to the journey, about between six and 14 days, depending on the ship type. And that in, in, in turn will lead to disruption and delays for goods coming in and potentially impact on prices as we go forward. La mer Rouge est une voie de communication clé par laquelle transitent près de 12% des biens mondiaux. Ce trafic représente une valeur de plus de 1000 milliards de dollars par an. The Houthis have this ability to really threaten it because at the southern end of the Red Sea through the Bab al-Mandab Straits that lie between Yemen and Djibouti, it's only about 18 to 20 miles wide. A choke point. Les Houthis sont un groupe pro-chiite soutenu par l'Iran. Ils ont attaqué des dizaines de navires pour soutenir les Palestiniens, suscitant la crainte d'une escalade du conflit. Aussi, des navires de guerre ont été envoyés par une force multinationale dirigée par les États-Unis pour rétablir la sécurité dans la région. La tâche s'avère être difficile. The Houthis say that they're going to continue these attacks as long as the Israeli attacks on Gaza continue. It's tapping into that really deep anger at the massive amount of destruction, loss of civilian life in Gaza, the nature of the Israeli bombardment. The United States and its allies have some options. They can be very aggressive. They can decide to, to take out some of these positions, although It's very difficult in the hills of Yemen to do this targeting. The Houthis were able to send missiles into Saudi Arabia to hit Saudi targets, including vital oil infrastructure, and also into the United Arab Emirates. It has missiles that can go well over 1,000 miles. So very dangerous. It's a massive escalation. But doing nothing could also be very problematic. Pendant ce temps, l'augmentation de la consommation de carburant causée par des voyages plus longs impacte déjà l'environnement. There is one cost that is going to be certain. It is the environmental cost that we all or our planet has to pay actually. There will be an additional 25, 30 or even up to 35% of carbon emission, additional carbon emission. Uh, the shipping industry is responsible for the 3% of all the emissions in the world. Uh, it's a huge number actually.